Welcome to 92.2, the number one jazz conspiracy station on the southern, west, eastern, western, most, and coast. That's right, I'm here. And I'm Freddie Fred, and I'm here with uh, my co-host, Jordan. <laughs> Jew. Emphasis on the Jew. Orden. Emphasis on the Jew. And we have... And Ebenezer Screws. Not Scrooge. Don't trust it. It's Ebenezer Screws, because I be screwing you. Oh, God. All day and all day. He'll be fucking all you day. all Christmas past, oh, present, I'll and be, future. I'll be turning you over with the, my cornucopia. Your mother will come every Christmas. Damn right. Bye, humbug, bitch. <laughs> We nah, we got erase this shit. This shit's retarded. No, this is no, this is great. Oh, this is keep it going. No, what are we? Oh, we better keep this shit going. Who the hell Listen, was that? Was that some random normal guy that ran into the studio? Maybe what I just got, I just got, I got, I got, I got intervened by the Holy Spirit of some random ass white boy that don't mm. even know what the hell he's talking about. But See, right now, it was a spirit, but not the spirit. That's right. Ooh, no, that's, that's what right. I'm talking about that's maybe. right. It was a spirit. That was some random ass. Cracker ass spirit coming so, up in this motherfucker. So the question of the day on ninety two point two is it KY or Astro Glide, brother? What, do, what K- are you, boy, baby boy? It's called KY jelly. You got that? You got to do that peanut butter and KY jelly. You put that peanut butter on that KY jelly and you slide. Uh, 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 that shit. Uh, that like that it seems like korean fried chicken for the butthole that's right son sometimes <laughs> sometimes sometimes we fuck around here at 92.2 but let me tell you what listen hey we are pro woman's rights we are pro woman's rights and we are pro woman's rights we gotta if it's a woman's rights to choose whether or not she wants to sell us that sweet sweet googie googie Oh yeah, baby. The yeah. woman gets to choose which cage she wants to sleep in for the evening. Woman gets to choose. I'm it's her right. right to choose whether or not she wants to charge fifty or one hundred dollars on that skanky panky. And absolutely, do you charge extra to fake an orgasm? You need to let us know here at ninety two point two, the blues. The blues, baby. I'm for her right to choose if, as long as she chooses me. And if she doesn't, <laughs> then I hope she burns in hell. Because guess what? If your motherfucking ass <laughs> ain't trying to do the dirty shit, <laughs> well, my motherfucking friend right here, your ass gonna burn in the motherfucking hell. Your ass ain't ready for the Christians down here in Louisiana, ninety two point two, ninety two point two five. Yeah. Y'all fucking around. <laughs> y'all was there saying, ready to see the Lord come down here and tell y'all. They showing a living right about the, tell about the motherfucking by the, uh, Thessalonians. Tell them. Motherfucker Trapalonians. But don't hurt them. Hey, motherfucker, listen to this right here. You let them know. The Lord came down and said, hey, let the, let the ones that be blind not be blind no more. Careful. And let the. I let the ones that be be be, be throwing that thing around. <sighs> I don't want to be doing it no more. That's what I got. Now, <laughs> Yo, keep now, bro- brother Jew Orden, uh, what do we do with these hoes sliding up in these DMs that end up being bots? They get us all excited, but they never follow through. We exercise uh, them. Exercise? Yes. How? Like we doing li- weights and shit? No, I mean like cast demons out. Ooh, I like that. Cast out demons. What's the process to cast some demons out, brother Jew Orden? We say, uh, get out of these bitches. Get out demons. of these bitches. Listen, here, that means y'all got devil. That means y'all got devils out. in your pussy. He, and sometimes the devils be living in your pussy, and that needs to get gone. Cause get you, out. You can't be raising kids with devils in your. Of pussy. these That's bitches, right. the demons in your G spot. That's, right. That's right. No, he's not. No, That's he right. is not. No, he's not. Where does the de- Where does the devil rely, Jordan? The G spot. The G stands for God. That's right. It's God's spot. That's God's spot. That's where God relies. Where is uh, uh, the devil? You can't fake an orgasm with the Lord. 
<laughs> but but where does the devil where does the devil reside? God damn it! He resides in your booty. Hole. That's right. The devil lives in that ass. And if you out here asking men for anal and you got kids running around the house asking mama, where's the Welch's fruit cups? The Lord is going to the hell because listen, the devil lives. Uh, Oh, the devil lives in that ass. But Lord, God damn, the Lord lives in that G spot and you need it and up in that critical. And that's why you need to choose the G spot. That's right. And that's if you today. bought Beyonce's album, repent. That's right. Repent. Lemonade, lemonade, lemonade. Be honest with yourself and with the Lord. Repent. That's right. That's right. Some of y'all is out there be like, Lord, what do I got to do to get some money to pay? Uh, to pay these bills to to and some of y'all is like God what I got to do cause this car note's coming up oh, oh. and some of y'all is like I get this car note's coming up my baby daddy he ain't got no money you know what you got to do hey hold on why we call it a car note instead of just a bill because sometimes that car be writing you notes be like hey <laughs> I need I need to get took care of uh, <laughs> Some of y'all was like, "What I got to do?" <sighs> oh, brother, that, that was almost satanic, brother. I just wanted to stop. Oh, I'm you sorry. Before I'm you sorry. Yo, way. hold on. I went the wrong before way. You, this okay, is the seven. I, yeah. I went to six. It's mirrored. Remember, I went go. to seven. I, listen, listen here. Some of y'all got to realize y'all talking to baby daddies and baby mamas that ain't no good for y'all. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And baby fathers, depending on the year you. That's right. That's right. <sighs> That's right. Oh, oh brother, hold on. I feel I feel an emergence coming from you. There's something coming from my spirit right now that I I really want them to know. What is it? Y'all got it. You know what? Hold on. Uh, hold on a second. Shall we? Shall hold, we on, hold on. Hold on. Just a second. Y'all y'all pray. God, I, I'm to go. Lord Jesus, be with Brother Aaron now. Be with him as whatever it is that is causing his spirit to stir. Ah! Help him. Help him. Ah! Ah! I used to not be able to read books, but now I can read books. Show me a word. I can read it because I used to be... Illiterate, but now I can read. Ah, ah, what does it say? Take off the ill, leave the erit. I'm literate. <laughs> Some of y'all don't even know what we talking about. Some of you, pay attention. I'm looking at you. Yep. Yes, y'all be been Ill. brainwashed by Drano. Don't the system. be ill. Be literate. literate. That's right. Literate. Some of y'all ain't read y'all's Bible. You know why? Because you can't. <laughs> yeah, some of y'all ain't read y'all's Bible because y'all been in the Reginald's side chick. <laughs> some of y'all at the Waffle House eating grits can't look at the menu and read it because you don't know what it says. That's what the pictures is for. Don't just read the pictures. You need Bible with pictures. The Bible don't got no pictures. All the Bible's got is red words from Jesus and black words from everybody else that says shit. And y'all don't even get it. And we all know the reading level at the Huddle House is two grades higher. Huddle yeah. House is the devil. <laughs> Huddle House ain't from G. What the fuck's a huddle? Huddle. <laughs> what is a huddle? Other than a bunch of men what getting together, <laughs> telling secrets, and hating the Lord. Y'all got to go to Waffle House and for look at the pictures for heterosexual fried. That's right. Morning treats. I'm sick of it. Huddle. What the fuck does Huddle have to do with a pancake? Can somebody what tell me? But you know what the hell Huddle's got to do with it? What? Hell. <laughs> Burning in that shit. Huddle in is the Greek word for hell. Huddle is the Greek word for hell. Y'all heard it. 
It's true. Go ahead first. Say it's it one more time. Fact. Say it it's one more time. Fact Say it one more time for him. Say it one more time for him. In Greek means hell. That's right. Hell house. And house That's right. means sing. Hell sing. Hell sing. Van Helsing. Hell. Van. Hell. Hell. Sing. Get it. Do y'all need to hear anything else? I'm sick of this shit. I'm tired of it. Because y'all need it fed to you. And sometimes it don't be talked like that. Uh, free Alex Jones. <laughs> he ain't even not free. He needs to get out. I'm sick of this shit. Y'all be mother of God. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's frogs. Okay. Them frogs is gay. And if you And he called it first. He because did. he went to a club called Frogs and Cowboys. And he was dancing with the frogs. And they're like, hey, you want to go back to our room tonight? And Alex Jones was like, why am I going back to these frogs' rooms? And then they made sexual advances at Alex Jones. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Senor Frogs is a pedophile ring. Senor mm -hmm. Frogs is a pedophile ring. Brought to you by ha, 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 Tequila. That shit's like broke back mountain, but with frogs. Broke back mountain. <laughs> Featuring <laughs> The Rock and Kevin Hart, guys. Find it on TNT Max. I wish. Don't that let plus. them listen. They're all over Netflix. They're all over all this other stuff. They're trying to brainwash your kids. Little bit of Kevin Hart. Hey, I'm short. Little bit of Rock. Hey, I'm big. Little. They, then they start kissing and Next stuff. Next thing you know, your son's gay. You know who else is? You know who else? You know. You know who? Uh, you, 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 you know who else? You know who else? You, you want to know who else is in this? Who? You know. Tiffany Haddish. No, you know who it is. Tiff you know Tina no, Fey. No, you know who it is. And when I say it, you're gonna be like. <laughs> Oh, Meg the Stallion. No. Cardi B. You know what it is? The baby. No. Lil Baby. Mark Wahlberg. Oh, God damn it. Mark Wahlberg's gay. He wakes up at three in the morning. How can we feel it? How can we keep up with a man that wakes up at three in the morning? Three in the morning. Goes to bed at seven. Hates his family. He wakes up at Conveniently three. asleep. Up at Looks three at his children and says, Hey, <laughs> I'm going to bed. He wakes up at 3 a.m. and goes to sleep at 7 a.m. Mark Wahlberg. That's sweetie, right. sweetie, don't jump on daddy's stomach. You know, I, I got I to gotta wake up at 3 and 3.30 in the morning. Hey, don't wake me up at 2.30 in the morning. Daddy's going to have bags under his eyes. He can't be in blockbusters no more. I'm sick of it. I got to make five brothers with a trans fourth, fifth brother just to cover it. And Tyrese is good. I just want Andre 3000 and more movies. I'm sick of the way Hollywood treated him. Mark Wahlberg. 92.2. We're out here. Uh, this is the Fox. This is 92.2, the thunderstorm. We out here making sure that your young daughters get pregnant and start having some babies so that we can renovate this world. We want you to make sure that they're raised right so that they know that uh, global warming is real and that we want to recreate the world with a bunch of people. And we want them understand. to be brown babies, brown biracial That is babies. not at all what I said. <laughs> that makes me angry that he even fucking said that. Anyway, no, I'm sorry. Never mind. These are my co-hosts. Uh, we'll, we'll cover that on a different podcast. Follow me on um, Aryan Nation podcast. We <laughs> we got we're gonna it's, be doing it. And follow me on the Aryan. on the on the Black Lives Matter podcast uh, residual fund. And where can they find you, Jew Ferrand? Uh, Jew. Stabby stab mixstab dot com. <laughs> my my name is Jew Jew Abrams. <laughs> 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 Oh, were you the director of Jew Trek? Yes. <laughs> the <laughs> next generation. <laughs> he made a he made a he made a, a porno called Schindler's Piss. <laughs> 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 
1942. It was about golden showers during 1944. The, no, the number one jazz conspiracy station on the east, southern, west coast, most coast. The baby. only jazz conspiracy station. We we have, not only do we have conspiracy theories about just conspiracy theories, but we have conspiracy theories about jazz. Like, like uh, five, four, five, four, six, one. timing. Five, four timing on music. You know Ooh. what that's used to do? You know what five four is used to do? No, what? What is it? You know what it's used to do? What? Make you believe in the flat Earth, baby. Oh my God! Five four, that's right. You know what? You know what eight, eight six timing signature What's is used that? to do? What's that? Is that MK Ultra? Nah, bro. It's made to, to make you believe not only is the world flat, but on the other side, it's infinite. Of the ice wall this is the Garden of Eden. Oh my God! And do you know what five six timing is? What is that? that? It makes you believe that the Jews did nine eleven. That's right. But here's oh the my thing: God. some of these it all comes together. Some of the stuff we talk about is true. All of it. That's not one of them. But there's some of this stuff. All of it's true. Yeah. Five six. The Jews did nine eleven. But why did they do it? You to understand. save us money. Yeah, for sure. Two less buildings, two less mud buildings. Got to spend yeah, money right. on. So, so they could get the uh, because uh, <laughs> the the uh, Middle East was overpriced. Yeah, and they wanted that shit to be uh, reasonably priced. Yeah. So they were just like, "Yo, if y'all do this shit for us real quick, we can sell y'all shit at fractions of the dollar, and we'll give you twenty five percent of the earnings. We're gonna launder your money." This is a pro Israel clip. Hold on, let's pause here. Pause two seconds, real quick. Let's. This is a pro-Palestine clip. Oh, Cheer. No. No, All right, now we go like back, that. and this is where we start new, and we pick whichever side whenever the time comes. We'll is the world in. flat, bro? Fuck it, dude. It's, Are you round right now? Bruh. That problem solved. No, it, it, the world's flat. If two basketball players tell me the earth is flat, they're the tallest dudes around, bro. They should be able to see. Yeah. I don't, I don't even. I heard it was flat. And I didn't ask no more questions because what, what are the questions there to ask? It just makes so much sense. That is flat. Yeah. What yeah. is it? Huh? The world be looking like Maggie Gyllenhaal's hey, space. Yo, uh, when, when, when have you ever been to space? Oh, I don't even believe in space. Co-host ninety two. When you take a thicky, thicky, thick home, is she flat? Nah, bro. That okay, bro. Is round. Oh, so you believe you believe the world is round because the bitches is round. So, yeah, so you're bitches. saying you're saying the world is a slappy. Sense. Yeah, but here's the thing: you ever got you ever got the world pregnant twice? You would know more than me. You are a Dominican. She had aborted so my twice. I got, I got Mother Earth pregnant one time. She aborted that motherfucker, and I was like, "Why?" She was because you don't believe in Al Gore, and I was like, "But uh, oh, uh, damn. it's not that I don't believe in him. It's that he doesn't believe in himself." It's that motherfucker Al Gore don't believe so in himself. Moral. He's so soft spoken. How yeah? How you so how, close? How, how you gonna tell me the world's ending in monotone voice? Yeah, I'll kill he your has ass. The personality right of linoleum. <laughs> And your best boy's getting sucked off. That motherfucker got eight chromosomes. <laughs> Al Gore, more like Al Bore. <laughs> algorithm. The only reason I call it algorithm is because Al Gore be playing drums on that motherfucker. And I'd be like, damn, so what are you doing, man? <laughs> getting it in there. <laughs> it's just tight. More like Al Whore. Mm. <laughs> more like more like Al Gore. <sighs> more like more like Al <sighs> On a scale to one to five, I fuck Al Gore five. <laughs> For two more podcast listeners, I would I would let him fuck me. Yo, you would let Al Gore fuck you? For two podcast listeners, minimum, yes. Bro, would you let Al Gore fuck you for the end global warming? Um I would let on ninety two point two, the only station that believes in jazz conspiracy theories. I would let uh, what's the retarded uh, Swedish girl? I would let her peg me. Oh, you talking about Greta Van? Yeah, uh, Greta uh, Van Fleet. Yeah, she. She. Wait, how old is she? <laughs> how, how old wow! is she? Wow! Oh, the earth is dying. 
Crap all. What's her name? Greta. Greta is Greta something. Greta Thunberg. Greta Van Susteren Jr. Greta. Greta. Greta Thorn. <laughs> Greta Thornberry. Yeah. She's like the world is going to block you. I'm going to block you. And liberals are like, yes, child, lead us, lead us to the promised land of a clean <sighs> water. It's because motherfucking liberals are fucking stupid, and every time they believe in somebody, they're a fourteen year old that ain't got no damn. That's how much Trump had him in a chokehold. They were just, they were just like, in that's right. Motherfucking people don't even, people don't even understand what they were doing. With uh, Trump won because the left was like, let's listen to this fourteen-year-old dumb bitch. He hey. choked them, but if they liked it a lot. If you read Trump, and and, and, and Biden was, was like, it? and Biden was just like, yo, if she's liberal, let me smell her real quick. They they scrub they scrub those off the internet very quick, brother. Bottom was like, let me smell Greta Thunberg, and she was like, no. And he was like, you smell like floor floor carvings. <laughs> this bitch full of shit. <laughs> Bottom was like, let me smell that bitch, uh, and he smelled her, and he was like, I smell fear. She, Gret- she, and that's when she disappeared. That's why she wasn't allowed back on the national stage. She was actually a piece of the ozone layer that materialized. Yo, bro, I'm in telling real life. you, bro, she was stardust. <laughs> and her time was up after she completed her it, duties. It was done. She she was she was brought to you by Skynet. She was a spirit in limbo. That That's right. To complete, to complete it. She had unfinished business like Casper. And they put her back in the machine and that bitch disappeared because Biden didn't want her no more. He saw her as a threat. He could smell the threat on Thurnberg's backside. He yeah. was like, this woman's going to destroy everything I helped build. And then his son smokes a little bit of crack and he was like, I agree, daddy. And then both of them proceeded to lose every single thing that they've ever written anything down in before at all. And then Biden sniffed Thunberg and he said... She smells like European spices. That's right. Cilantro. Yeah, and he was he was really ready to attack Eastern Europe, but then she was just like, "You're taking away my childhood." <laughs> and he was like, oh, "Okay, oh, I'm not gonna do that. That's crazy." <laughs> he he sniffed her so much that he became he became snow uh, nose blind. Yeah, to her smell. It was like cocaine. Yeah, but with Greta Thunberg's DNA. They Ooh. kept her around so much that Biden was like, "I don't know whether she's coming or going, but I know I'm coming." But he, he was, but Biden be coming. Biden comes big loads. He's Biden his time until he's coming. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Biden, we'll going. Com- Biden comes loads big enough to make to make bands be like. He he, the, like I remember Imagine Dragons one time. I met them. I met Imagine Dragons one time, and I was like talking to Imagine Dragons, and I was like, "Hey, what's up, Imagine Dragons? How y'all doing?" And they're like, "You haven't met Joe Biden?" And I was like, "No, I, I ain't never met Joe Biden." Imagine Dragons, and they're like, "Yo, that motherfucker be coming a lot." <laughs> uh, Ima- Imagine Dragons was like, "That's what that's on Thunder." And they said that They're like thunder was, They said his cum was radioactive Radioactive <laughs> <laughs> They said they said he used to spank his ass with both hands when he came And that's what the song Thunder is about When Joe Biden slapped his ass with both hands And he was like oh And they were like thunder The, the thunder That's when Yeah that's right That's, that's, that's a jazz uh, conspiracy theorist um, imagine dragons they used to hang around with Joe Biden and when he would come thinking about young girls who spank his ass with both hands and they were and, and, and they it made it sound sound a lot like a thunder. Thicker, thicker thunder that's exactly right mm-hmm. uh, any any last thoughts I don't think we've had first thoughts <laughs> this has been pure retardation uh, any middle thoughts you mean specialization that's I right like that. yeah we are all retarded. We are all one. This podcast rides the short bus to school. But you know who else rode the short bus? What if, what if uh, Rosa Parks rode the short bus and nobody ever really talks about this? <laughs> <laughs> Rosa Parks was just on the short bus. She's just like, I want to ride on the front. And they're like, sit the fuck back down, lady. She's like, no. I refuse. And then Imagine Dragons was like, thunder. And she's like, you know what? I'll sit back where I don't, I don't like this song. <laughs> <laughs>
And like, just get in the back. It's like two seats back. Just and she's like, no. How do you how do you feel about uh? How do you feel about um? Consp- what's the conspiracy theory you feel like you can get up on? That you can that, that, one that's more well known, or one that I made up that in my head. Birds aren't real. I actually feel oh, like I can get behind birds. That. Bullshit. Pigeons aren't real. Like the biggest thing I've ever seen is like you ever seen a baby pigeon? Uh, motherfuckers I'm come out middle age. No, yeah, no, because pigeons stay with their kids. Is I'm it making like, you uncomfortable that I'm licking your microphone? No, no, no. Oh, yeah. I, have, I have fucking refills, bro. Good, I feel actually. like we're being. It smells like a woman. We're being yeah. real. The part yeah, of me that is like Joe Biden knows that. Yeah, it smells like the cousin I'm most attractive to. Dude, his name's Alan. Yeah, I'll suck his dick. Oh, the guy cousin. <laughs> oh, damn it. Huh? Dude, I, I thought it was a girl with a guy's name because that's hot too. That'll make me come faster too. Bro, I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, if I had a cousin, that, if I had a, I feel like I would bang a dude family member quicker than I would bang a dude in real life. Makes sense, right? That's fucking. Yeah. Why is it that like there's like female Sams, but there's no female John? Why not John? Dude, why I, don't I, they want to steal that one? That's true. Here's what I think, guys. If you're here, if you're listening, if a man comes back, here's here's one of the laws. I don't know how you guys will. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go into we're gonna go into a law you would make if you were in charge of things. Here's a law I would make if I was in charge of things. A law I would make if I was in charge of things is if soldiers come back home and they find their lady <laughs> and cheating with somebody. They get to kill him. If a soldier comes back home and he's been at war for a year and he comes home and he finds his lady cheating with a guy, he finds him. He, he sees it happening. He gets to kill everybody in the house, dogs, children, aunts and uncles, maybe even his own mother. He's even, the gold, shoot, even the goldfish. Goldfish. He gets to eat it, rip its head off like Ozzy. <laughs> he gets to do that. And nothing happens to him. What if his girl cheats with a lady? And he gets he they they both belong to him now. She cheats with a man. He kills everybody in the house. If he if she cheats with a lady, that's kind of hot. He owns both of them for for the remainder future. He gets to be like, hey. My oil needs to be changed today. I, I like that logic. That seems yeah, logical to me. That's what I feel. Dominance. I feel that. In its purest form. I feel that way. Freddie, what law would you legislate? Um Oh. If somebody verbally like social law if somebody can verbally like I don't know. You can slap the shit out of somebody if they come out their mouth, you know? And the courts will be like, nah, you fucking like there's already video cameras, right, in the streets. Now there's resonance cameras that detect passive aggression, so they can tell whether you're telling a joke or not. So if you're being a cunt, you get slapped in your face. The court's like, no, fuck you. But if you're joking, and the other person still get to court, uh, Wait, that who, person goes to jail. Who are you slapping? You're slapping so, your you're slapping your lady. No, 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 no. I'm thinking oh. men. Men that act like ladies. Mm. Yeah. Men that identify as men, but they're really ladies. But they're against transgenders. You know these guys? Okay. Yeah. They get to act like pieces of shit. Yeah. I'm tired of <sighs> um, What time is it? We got to shut this shit down. Something I would legislate is an express lane for people who need to shit. If you need to Ooh. shit, you get to go 120 miles Agreed. per hour. <laughs> there's like a, there's like an arrow over your head that shows like, oh, he has to take a shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's you, you gotta <laughs> fart into a blower, like like it's a breathalyzer. Like if you fart hard enough in a the blower, they're like, we have this man's got to go. Yeah, he's got to go. <laughs> For fifty dollars extra, you can just go right here, sir. <laughs> like. We can tell by your gas levels. <laughs> we can tell by your toxins. Ninety-two point two 
the Thursday night thunderstorm. We're out here on a Tuesday night. We're out here hanging out. We're letting people know that not everything is as it seems. And sometimes people aren't following their dreams. But a lot of times people need to do what they do. So that everybody can come back and be the best person they can to you. It's good times. If you find a... Has anybody, has anybody got any closing arguments? Uh, if you find two tampons in your woman's, in your woman's vagina, just ask a couple of questions. Here's what you need to do. He's uh, elaborating upon that. You need to, you need to buy um some spermicide. They come in little tubes. You pop the top off and squeak up inside your woman's paha, and uh, you can sh- um keep those at the house because um. She's letting people she's letting people do the nasty up inside of her. She'll use those. And it's okay, it's okay to let can. them do the nasty up inside of you. But what we need to do is we need to take at least two eggs from every attractive woman. Thus right. ensuring that the next generation is as hot as the current one. That's right. With all this feminism coming around, y'all ain't trying to have no babies. No ugly babies. But we're trying to make some babies. We're trying to elaborate upon we, some babies. And we want hot babies. That's right. We don't and by want that I mean babies, babies who will be hot people. Not, we won't not s- that they're hot now. That's, yeah. that's just strange. <laughs> we want babies we can fuck. Eventually. <laughs> <laughs>